a bit of timing, Aspas. This could be everything for you and your side, or it could be dead and gone. It could be all for nothing, and that is a problem. Now you're surrounded. You don't know how much danger you're in. You just saw it. Aspas has to run. Gets to keep his life. 87 HP, away. and he's still standing. And he's gone back for more. He's gone more. That's a spike mid. now seen as well. So telling at this time. The rest of the team is on the way through caves. Adjust so well. Punishing it. Oh! Can you believe it? Aspas beheads crashes. And the other two turn plan. They're looking towards B. They want none of what he's selling. Have a lineup for the open door to bounce off the texture. But uh, fair play either way. Good night and sweet dreams to you, Jing. Absolutely pacey take. He's bouncing all over the place, making it look like total oh wipeouts on my screens. This guy is destroying. Farming up towards that showstopper, another oh, victim close. Day. We might have an ace on our hands. Way into shoulder instead, all the way down to elbow now, and they're in the back of the ace site, really oh. having to play off of everything. Oh, oh. my goodness, Asna is up in the air. It's, it's not a bird, it's not a plane, it's the duelist. He's good for two. They'll use this toxic screen actually against the 100 Thieves. He just tried to work their way just a little bit into this peak. Pillars are coming through for 100 Thieves to try to get themselves back in. Showstopper now forward. Asna has hit all three showstoppers. This man is different. Actually different with this thing, and the second fight to come with it, a double every time this man is ulted. Eventually they're going to be grouped and going for it, north side secure with the trap they've got. They're not too worried about their back for now, time is on the side. In they go, Judge ready, but it doesn't hit! <laughs> He's even stunned up as well, I think. He was stunned up, but it's just the first bullet accuracy of RB is off the charts. Get it here? Yep, stun. Stuns himself. Instant headshot. Yeah, yeah, yeah. all right. Okay. <laughs> okay, okay. Open sight lines with Scream still actually finds it. And oh, the reveal actually lands inside the dark cover. So no information garnered on the back of that now. The swing through. This is good. It's just SSK look though. The, look at the HP. They're down to nothing, but they're still making a good, good try. Oh, the TP away. Does he still have a chance? Oh, can he throw the diffuser? But I think it was a second too late. No, he got it. Yes, he got it. He got the ace and clutches it out. That molly lands a Chichu. Can't fight this one. Flash with the Trailblazer. It's all coordinated together towards the back though. There's a judge waiting for them. Do they dare step? Do they dare venture? Kang Kang falls. It's Paper X in control. Lovely response, ready for it, and something Whoa! in their faces! I'm wondering what's spurring that on, but either way, they're going to have more challenge to deal with Cryo here against three. There's a flash waiting on the other side. Alphier. Waiting for contact. Alphier and There's the flash. There it is, and the turn! Cryo gets one, BCJ shows up in time! And now the rolling thunder, as Ekin tries to survive. What? But easy, BCJ is the hero yet again! He's gotten three on the round! Two legendary opportunities there for Durka. The 1v5 just now, the 6k before. Look at this TP from BCJ. He TPs in to the Rolling Thunder, just in time to avoid the stun. Yeah, they're matching him step by step. You're not going to get an easy fight. Mind Freak, how does he play this? 10 HP, he's got to be... Yeah, he doesn't have the chance on it. Zeke is now going to pop on through. It's going to reveal their are presence towards heaven. Demon 1 turns around, takes him down. Something's gone. And now for the... Oh my god! Above and beyond! For the spike, they need to get towards the site, and it's on Demon One to do it. He's gonna get the plant down and now Divide. It's only a stinger. Huge to trade out there. Ethan trying to backfill this space now. Alpha, I don't think he will know the second player here. Oh, but Bustio, he didn't see either. Wait, Bustio's cooking up something here. Oh, he's going ridiculously too deep. But Demon One, up for the trade. Look at Darka! Oh, he's got the moves! Darka dodges everything! Durka slips into bullet time somehow there. Avoiding everything. God bless Demon One for trying. Look at this. How? <laughs> that is That's ridiculous. From Durka. Good job. Okay. And they're gonna go, it looks like, for another south side crunch. They have both duelists over towards Tree. Yep. They're not worried, are they? But they're going up against a half bite. Start oh, yeah. No way! Oh. Jing, your movement is just impeccable. It's up to EDG. Take up the space quickly. Rapid is the approach. Through halls, Dash is active, but they are feeling the hurt from that one. They're going to be left reeling. He has not been in the right place in almost every round. This could be it. Artist, though, finally staring down on the right angle. RB just around the corner. The speed that he takes this corner is really what's jarring. And a good jump peak to start with, and a missed shot after. Uh, RB just cannot miss as he misses. And he's still going to get the kill. <laughs> he's still going to get the kill. Cross being punished by Lewis. 
From G2, now they're left with the big boys. This is the one that's going to make the difference. And sprints into it. That's the man you wanted to see. You call his name and he shall appear. Lewis making it look good. And Nookie, I mean, you got the operator and I'm sure you want to keep it. But this round, you ain't going to get it. Lewis, what a way to make his name on the board. Ghana has immediately okay. found a kill with the operator too. Just peeking. I mean, there's just no slowing down, is there? Feels like round after round. And that was BCJT being into spawn. He's been dealt with, shorty up close, has to reload that one, Garnet. He's breaking ankles out here, man, and he's found the kill anyway. What are we witnessing? Wow, everything in that round, from BCJ teleporting into spawn to the, the double shorty kill from Garnet. It's a great opener. Garnet's clearly very talented with the off, but so many of these rounds are getting silly with it, aren't they? Yeah. I feel this isn't going to be ideal if they lose that pit. Everything could fall apart. They have to hold on on site. Zolkas just about clinging to life. And he goes down, but it's into the 1v1. This can still be one. Yuppie, one bullet away. Mixwell was so low that a K was in. Rolling Thunder is dodged. That is gorgeous from Yuppie. 12 to 10. They're like, we're not giving any rope tricks up this time. All the utils watching back and forth. Oh boy. Boomba, check it out. Oh boy. That's off of the info that he's able to pick up from Garage again because of the aggressive oh. positioning that he got. Starting to feel that, okay, they're not working their way in through Garage. Good chance they're working their way in mid as they've done before. Great use of the utility. Here we go. The show's oh over. He's up above it. Kessie yes. able to dodge it and get the kill. The counter spam may be in order, but no kills to be found. No damage either. The Nana Swarm's already been cleared. It's a bait and switch, and they wait out the util. Here's a Sancho play. What is that? No, he's count on Jing, and he has just broken apart the defense. In the blink of an eye. You can feel it, they are fired up for this. Can't believe the movement here, I mean. What an entry. Yo, what? I mean, it's two improbable entries, one after another. Rolling Thunder for the side itself. It's not gonna catch anybody out towards short. This is huge for Loud. They've got the manpower still to work with. And as Team Liquid run forward, they're not expecting them to be stacked up like this, ready to take the duels, having retaken the map control after the Rolling Thunder. Well handled by Loud Screams, making a good attempt at it! Up in the air, uh, somehow! Oh, how does he get sassy? How does he get sassy? Sneaky, aggressive push on A main, no, that's, completely that's, catching that's them the off. Thing. It wasn't I sneaky. Just, they spotted him. They well, saw it. him in the corner. He fake up drafted away and then just stayed and peeked out and oh, killed stop. everyone. This is this oh, was stop. the least sneaky play oh, I've ever seen in my life. And Kellogg's comes out with four kills. Backs against the wall, do they have it in them? It feels like when the pressure's on, this is sometimes where EDG play their best. And a lot of it comes down to this man. All eyes on Kang Kang already. Double satchel in his face! Jing removes him. What do you do when a star player is shut down in that kind of fashion? And you see the reaction from him there on the player cam. The sudden gutting feeling that he's let it all slip away. Watch this! My ult's ready. One enemy remaining. There's a frenzy on Bankai for final round of half. Look, it's not ideal, but Jing's gone. He's sending it again, the reveal's huge! Jinx got two! That play has been teased again and again, and finally, Paper X get the success out of it. Idea there from Meadow hasn't quite we'll worked see. out in practice, and Zeke has found another Nukia. Is he the playmaker that gets G2 into this round again? Oh, oh wow, God. just aerial movements! This guy's a gymnast! Nukia with lethal! Gymnastics has taken down another. Off as Bustio gets taken down. Apoth stunned up. Wardell once more. He's gonna get it dancing around. Goes Jogamo when he's up close. He might do it again. The classic, what? no, the shorty. And Jogamo goes huge. It's side tankers that are able to play into Baby Bay has got to be one of the options that they consider. Dodging, oh. juking. I mean, Baby Bay's oh. making a mockery of oh. this man. 
He's gone for the knife kill at the end. The rest of his team is like, listen, we're not taking any chances. They are looking to retake that mid space. Kind of ballsy because they didn't know that Jet was not there anymore. Mikaela has to find some value here. You've seen playing on the other side of the smoke, and you've got Blue waiting. Did she not get spotted? How is she alive? What is this? Whoa! Whoa! How? How did she get two? What is going on? How does she stay alive that long without taking any damage? And still get two.